Today on MTG Unpacked, we'll be cracking open a booster box of Ether Revolt. Uh, this video will be in two parts. We'll do half the box now and half in the next video. Uh, there will also be a short version where the common cards are cut out. So if you notice a bit of strange editing, uh, you're probably looking at the short version. So without further ado, let's crack this open. And all the planeswalkers fall down. <laughs> Alright. So let's see, we have three, six, twelve. So we'll do uh, 18 packs in this video. Okay, let's get cracking. And uncommon is Lifecrafter's Gift, Lifecraft Awakening, Spire Patrol, and Sram Senior Edificer is the rare. Ironclad Revolutionary is the uncommon. Reverse Engineer. Aerial Modification. And ho oh, ho! There we go. Planeswalker Tezzeret the Schema. So his uh, plus one. Create a colorless artifact token named Ethereum Cell with tap. Sacrifice this artifact, add one mana of any colour to your mana pool. Uh, minus two target creature gets plus X minus X until end of turn, where X is the number of artifacts you control. And his ultimate, minus seven, you get an emblem with at the beginning of combat on your turn. Target artifact you control becomes an artifact creature with base power and toughness five five. Uh, he starts off with loyalty five. So, it's a Planeswalker, I'll take it. I'm not sure that he's especially high value, but uh, it's always nice to get a Planeswalker. Trophy Mage is the uncommon. Deft Dismissal. Efficient Construction. And your Henny's expertise is the rare. Uh, the uncommon is Winding Constrictor, Ravenous Intruder. Vengeful Rebel and Paradox Engine. Alright, it's probably worth a few bucks. Let's see, Mythic. Alright, so two Mythics so far, not bad. Uh, uncommon is Ironclad Revolutionary, Sly Requisitioner, Ridge Scale Tusker. Some sort of armadillo thing. <laughs> and Lifecrafter's Best Cherry is the rare. Okay, next. Restoration Specialist is the uncommon. 
hidden stockpile. That one's uh, good in the Aristocats deck that I'm playing right now. Crackdown Construct and Hajani Hand Yielding. There you go. Let's see if there's a resemblance here. Yep. Alright. Colouring's a little different though. So we get a plus two, reveal the top three cards of your library, put all non-land permanent cards revealed this way into your hand and the rest on the bottom of your library in any order. Minus two XL target creature, its controller gains life equal to its power. Minus nine, put five plus one plus one counters on each creature you control and five loyalty counters on each other planeswalker you control. Whoa. It's pretty good. Um, he starts off with four loyalty. So that's pretty cool. Another mythic planeswalker. So he can keep Tesseract company. Alright. So far I've got a pretty good box. And the uncommon gifted Etherborn. Barricade Breaker. Oh, Fatal Push. That's a good one. And Heroic Intervention. This is, uh, looks like Ajani's doing something here. Defending somebody. Oh, and we get a Foil Green Will Liberator. This is a Foil Rare, so... Not sure how much that's worth, but I'll check it later on. Alright. And the uncommon is Morphist Revolutionary. Felidar Guardian. Sorry you're banned, mister. You can't be played in standard. Barricade Breaker. And Spire of Industry is the rare. Alright. Uncommon is Salvage Scuttler. Dead Eye Harpooner. Illusionist Stratagem, and release the Gremlins! Not these guys again, causing so much trouble. This one creates uh, Gremlin creature tokens. Alright. Next pack. Scrapper Champion. Salvage Scuttler. Pacification Array, and a Greenwell Liberator. Just a regular non-foil this time, and we get a Watchful Automaton. Foil. Alright. Uh, uncommon is an Ornithopter, Enraged Giant, Efficient Construction, and a Solemn Recruit is the rare. Okay, on to the last one on the second pile here. So that'll be two thirds of the way through. The Uncommon is an Outland Boar. Scrapper Champion, Siege Modification, and Consulate Crackdown is the rare. Oh, we also get a Sly Requisition of Foil. Alright, another foil to add to the collection. Uncommon is a Dead Devil Dragster, World Fast Engineer, 
Crunch select Dreadnought and Walking Ballista. All right, that's what we're after. These are pretty nice. Okay, so Walking Ballista. Pretty happy with this box so far. Let's see what we can pull in the next pack here. Uncommon is a Winding Constrictor. Thopter Arrest. Servo Schematic. And a Green Belt Rampager is the rare. Big elephant with multiple tusks here. Uncommon is a trophy mage. Lifecraft awakening. Spire patrol and a glint sleeve siphoner is the rare. Okay, three packs left. The uncommon is a Morphist Revolutionary, Rogue Refiner, another hidden stockpile, and SRAM's Expertise. Alright, this is another one I play fairly regularly. Get the uh, servo tokens and start doubling those up with Anointed Procession. And you've got a whole ton of tokens before you know it. Works pretty well usually. Until somebody does a fumigate. And uncommon is a treasure keeper. Rogue Refiner, Efficient Construction, and Yehani Undying Partisan. That's another one I play fairly regularly. I like the uh, sacrifice ability of this guy. Ooh, we get a Iron Tread Crusher foil. That's pretty cool. And the last pack for this video. Uncommon is a Salvage Scuttler. Reverse Engineer. Oh, a Felidar Guardian again. And Battle at the Bridge is the rare. Looks like Tezzeret's up to no good there. Okay, so that is the first half of the first Eta Revolt booster box opening on the channel. If you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you'd like to see more Magic the Gathering unboxing videos. Uh, stay tuned for the second part of this. We'll open the rest of the box. And have a great day.